Art history has a secret language and each time that you are in front of a painting you have to uh, try to translate it and make the people understand it because if we look at a work of art with our modern eyes we don't see even one third of what you are supposed to see. Renaissance is uh, the century in which the world um, opens its eyes again uh, towards the past. They started to rediscover the classical antiquity, they started to rediscover um, the beauty of also of the human body, which was forgotten in the Middle Ages, and that's the moment in which they rediscover also the power of rationality, the power of the mind. One of the most difficult aspects of Rome for the people that come from newer countries like North America, for example, or Australia, that is to say the concept that the city has many layers. Explore the layers, that's the greatest way to understand uh, how Rome was developed uh, across the centuries. I was um, giving a tour of ancient Rome uh, to a group and there was an engineer in this tour of the ancient Rome. A gentleman told me if I had done this tour 15 years ago, probably I would have uh, uh, chosen another life, probably I would have chosen to become an historian. And so this was uh, really great because it means that in some way you touch them. It's much more than just giving you a tour.